Yo, what's good everyone? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be going through some beginner tips to help you start off and get better at Roblox Rivals. I'm not the best myself, but when I was a beginner beginner, I used these tips a lot and they really, really helped me. Just a quick one, if you are new here, if you could please like and subscribe. It really means the world to me. And anyways, let's get into the video. Hope you enjoy. Just a quick one, these tips work for desktop and they also work for controller and they also work for mobile. So whatever you're playing on, these tips should always help you. I will be using the beginner loadout just so then you can get a feel for it yourself. And anyway, let's get into the video. Hope to enjoy. Okay, so the first tip, as you can see, I'm against a mobile player and this sort of brings us on to our first tip and that is to always move movement is such a key part of this game the reasons you need to move are because with like mobile players they've got like a mini lock on so if you stand still for too long they can lock on to you so as you can see what i'm doing right now i'm moving a lot because this guy's a mobile player and it's really hard to hit as a mobile player so just try to move around also if they've got an rpg just like this guy this guy is sweating his rpg but the good uh, counter for this is to always stay high because it's really hard to hit like directly as a player so they normally hit it like near you just like that so that's a mistake i made but i should be able to kill this guy but you always want to stay high when he is there and always move about so this guy is struggling as you can see he's making a mistake by karen using his rpg so he does not know where i am and he keeps trying to hit me so i can just stay up high move about all over this just use some jumps and simple as that he can't really hit me i have fell down a little bit here but i'm just gonna come back up because as long as he keeps using his rpg i should be okay just like he is now and we can get the win right now just like so number two is more of a mistake and that is to when you are close in combat do not zoom in to your scope just like i'm doing now he's close so there's no point in me doing my scope i'm just gonna free aim because i'm more likely gonna get more shots off because it's a lot harder when you're scoped in this is another go good example i can see that he's gonna grenade so i don't zoom in i kind of just play free and don't even zoom in with my pistol either kind of just take my time he's very low and he's zooming in you can tell yep so just to, when you're close in combat just do not zoom in like you can vary sometimes depending on the situation but most of the time you won't need to the last step in today's video or last tip is to utilize your grenade grenade is such a another key part of this game and by i mean by that is the first one is on the start like just like i'm doing now throw it in the back corner and i even hit him there that's one of the reasons why i mean to utilize it so i should be able to get the clean up on this kill now just like so another way to utilize the bomb is to do a bomb jump and this just consists of timing it will take a little bit of getting used to but it is very very effective in getting away just like that this just takes a little bit of time and a little bit of practice but once you get the hang of it it is very very useful in pushing an opponent running away from an opponent so it is very very good i do recommend trying to learn it if you though are still struggling what you can do is is what i'm doing right now you throw the grenade into the corner and then you like time your jump well it's still very very effective and it's also very very easy to learn or at least easier than just doing it freeway so i should be able to get the clean up on here and yeah that's another tip just not really a tip but the last little thing is just practice practice practicing your aim and practicing your movement will definitely increase how well you play and your gameplay if any of these tips did somehow help you if you could please like and subscribe really means the world to me hope you have a lovely rest of your day and i'll see you guys on the next one peace everyone